Hello friends. In this lecture, we will discuss one important problem of mathematics, which is from the topic probability. Okay. So before starting the discussion, I want to tell you that to get more important problem of mathematics, you can visit our website education-adda.com. Link is also available in the description box of the video. So to get the questions, what you have to do, you have to visit the website education-adda.com. Then you go to menu option and from there you will get academics adda. Click on that then you will get one tab called math important questions. So there you can get some more questions. You will also get some more important questions on our YouTube channel. And for that you have to visit the playlist titled as math important questions. Okay. So coming back to the question what is given? A production department has 35 similar milling machines. Okay. So there are 35 similar milling machines and the number of breakdowns on each machine that is average number is given as 0 0.06 per week. Okay. So per machine average is 0 0.06 per week. And we have to determine the probabilities of having one in part A, it is one machine breaking down in any week and in part B, it is less than three machines breaking down in any given week. Okay. So how we can solve this problem? See, what is given average number of breakdown per machine per week is 0 0.06 and we know the total number of machines is 35. So we can calculate average number of breakdown for 35 similar ma machines per week. It will be equal to 35 multiplied by 0 0.06 and it will give 2.1 machines per week. Okay. So 2.1 machines per week and we can see the average number is known. So we can use Poisson distribution to calculate the probabilities of breakdown occurring 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 times per week and it can be given by successive terms of the expression that is e to the power minus lambda multiplied by 1 plus lambda plus lambda square by 2 factorial plus lambda cube by 3 factorial plus lambda 4 by lambda to the power 4 by 4 factorial and so on. Okay. So where lambda is nothing but average number of breakdowns per week and which is 2.1. Okay. So we can calculate the probability of zero breakdown per week that is indicated by P0. So how we can calculate P0 or probability of zero breakdown per week. So it will be equal to C e to the power minus lambda into this first term that is 1 e to the power minus lambda into 1. So it will be e to the power minus lambda and value of e is 2.718 and power will be minus 2.1. So it will be equal to 0.1225. Similarly, we can calculate the probability of one breakdown per week and is denoted by P1. And we can find C e to the power minus lambda into second term that is lambda. So lambda into e to the power minus lambda and it will be 2.1 into 2.718 to the power minus 2.1. So it will be 0 0.2572. Similarly, we can calculate probability of two breakdown per week and it will be equal to lambda square e to the power minus lambda by 2 factorial. So how we got this? So this e to the power minus lambda into the third term that is lambda square by 2 factorial. So we will get this one and substituting the value of lambda we will get 0.2700. Okay. Now we have to find the probability of one machine breaking down in any week it will be P1. So already we have calculated P1 equal to 0.1225. So our answer will be 0 0.257, sorry P1, P1 is this one 0 0.2572, okay. So it is probability of one machine breaking down in any week. 
next part is probability of less than three machines breaking down in any week so it will be equal to probability of zero breakdown per week plus probability of one breakdown per week plus probability of two breakdown per week so it will be equal to p0 plus p1 plus p2 and substituting the values as calculated here see 0.1225 p0 and p1 is 0.2572 and p2 is 0.2700 so substituting these values we will get 0.6497 so this is the required probability okay friends so in this lecture we have discussed one important problem of mathematics from the topic probability okay thank you